Client Clinical is a course series that encapsulates after all these years of experience that I have and all the patients that I've treated and all the staff that I've trained, how do we treat? And how do we turn our patients around quickly? How to evaluate and how to start treating immediately. Our focus is on the patient and getting the information out of their body as to what do they need. We're like uh, body whisperers. Our specialty is in the structural piece of it and we work with other health practitioners as a team. The work that we do is we repair and reset structure. We make trauma unhappen. How do you get 80% of the patients better quicker? How do you start to work with the body as a unit to make changes fast? And how do you start to analyze what is actually the problem? Is it mind body, you know, is it emotional, is it psychological, is it structure, is it physiology, how do you assess that? I feel like hands that are highly trained can go deeper, better, faster, more efficient, efficient and effective than other modalities. So we're kind of old school here, but new school in that we do hands on 100% of the time. So we do give exercises, we have patients do things at home, to support the work that we do here. But this far into my career, I can tell you, I can turn most things around with my hands. We see patients who are very complex orthopedic cases, failed uh, laminectomies, failed fusions, failed spinal stenosis surgery, like physical trauma. We see patients who have complex neurological issues, post-stroke, cerebral palsy, autism, MS, Parkinson's. And then we have patients, we have a whole part of our practice that's for patients recovering from complex emotional and psychological trauma. So again, our patients come in and we tell them if you're coming in with a radicular pain issue, you should, you should see a big change within five visits. Concussion, you should see a change that day. So when patients come in, we expect that they're gonna feel different after every visit. If they do not, then we start to look at, okay, what else do we need to bring in? Do you need acupuncture? Do you need a physiology workup? Like what's wrong? So one of the most significant aspects of patient care is as a practitioner is to know what they need and when, and to understand when patients come in, what is structural, which is what we do, what is physiological and what is energetic, meaning mind, body, trauma, other issues. We are gonna be teaching two things. One is how do you figure out what's going on with your patient that's keeping them from healing, that all the great work that you're already doing is not working. And then we're gonna teach you how to work with every type of tissue in the body to reset it back to neutral. You don't have to not do what you're already doing you just integrate in what we're teaching you to make what you're already doing work better. So if you are a function-based physical therapist, great, who just wants more uh, manual skills, fantastic. If you are a massage therapist, if you're another body worker, you want, great. When we give you the techniques, what we're teaching you is how to, again, bring that into the patient's care, care uh, plan. And what we do with the structure should make whatever else you're doing work better. Just doing the functional alone, if the patient truly is in a little bit of a crisis, is not going to work. So that's where kind of we come in. I can't tell you the number of patients I've seen who were told they never run again, they never walk again. Too bad for them. Uh, you have a frozen shoulder, use the other arm. Like these are realistic things that my patients have been told. And we don't think that's acceptable. And we feel like that at this point in human history, with everything that we know, in terms of uh, physics, that you should be able to help a patient who's been deemed unhelpable to turn them around. So we help very complex patients. We try and make sense of what happened to them and fix them. And in my experience, every patient has the potential to be turned around, maybe not completely healed, depending upon what's going on with them, but helped. A patient who comes in and trusts you with their care, that that's a responsibility that we take very seriously. And we walk together with the patient on their health journey as far as we can. We help them as much as we can, and then we bring in other resources to the patient. Because our assessment techniques are really, really good, 
often we pick up things that the patient may need help with that they were unaware of. And we work with what we do structurally and then we, we help the patient to find what else they need in order to have a full healing. One of the foundation concepts that we'll be teaching in our foundation concept video is that the body never makes a mistake. And whatever the patient is coming in with, your job, should you choose to take that on, is <laughs> what happened and why is this patient not healing? The entire focus of what is going on with that patient is on the patient. And as we say, it's a personalized way of treating the patient because every patient is different. Every patient is coming in with their own history, their own genetics, their own frame of reference, what's happened to them. So what we've done is come up with a systematized tool that can help, okay, what happened with this patient? What I treat, what does that do? Every patient is unique. 